Frank, you, you wear these tags. Uh, does that have something to do with the condition? Yes. Um, after my second seizure, my GP recommended when I went to see him with my wife that it would be useful if I wore some form of ID. So if I had a seizure, people knew that it was a seizure, it wasn't drink or drugs or anything else. So I wear, for example, a very simple, sort of trendy military type ID tag, name, address, phone numbers, and a brief statement of my condition. It, it says seizures on the end, my date of birth, and I wear one on my wrist which just says uh, seizure disorder, things you can buy. It means if someone calls an ambulance, medics are trained as a reflex to check if I'm wearing a tag or an ID bracelet and they know straight away what it is. They won't know what a cavernous angioma is, it's a rare condition. So by saying seizures on both of them, they know I'm having a seizure and I can be taken to hospital and they'll be kept under observation. They know they won't need to panic first. You know, a consultant at the hospital would quickly look up the records and find out that a cavernous angioma or a cavernoma is, in my case, something just to be observed and see what happens. And watch that I don't hurt myself and I'm coming round out of it again.